All right, so I'm going to go over here to the indexes, and I want to see if it's starting to see events. And let's see how we're doing here. Let's go take a look right here. I'm going to go back to uh, receiving indexes. There you go. So on the left-hand side, data indexes, what I want to show you um, down at the bottom, that new event that we created, you can see now there's the actual size of the logs, right? Number of events, oldest event and newest event. That's what you want to see. So you know that you're bringing in data. We're doing good there. Now the next error, the next issue might be that you're not seeing it here on this home search screen. So up at the top, I click search, and I'm still not seeing any data. So that's the part where we say, okay, I'm going to go over here, and now I'm going to add data. So remember the different ways that we can pull data in. And what we're going to do is we're going to say forward. So this is what I was talking about. You see this data here, right? You see the host. We need to pull this in from, uh, we need to pull this in. So we're going to give it a new name. So we're going to give it a server class name. Okay, so I'm going to call it endpoint logs. I'm going to add this from here. So I want that host to be sent over here. And now it's pretty easy. I'm just going to say next. Now I want to pull the logs from this machine. So when I tell it that I want to pull the logs from this machine, you can see here's the logs that it can grab. Then I need to tell that sucker I want all of this stuff. Application logs, security logs, system logs. I want it all. So this is what we want to see. So now that I'm done with that, I can click Start Searching Events. Now you want to give it a minute, and you should see this start to show up in the main page now. So I'm just going to click on the main search page. So within a few minutes, you should be seeing something in here. This is what we want to see change in a few minutes. There we go. So I refresh the page, and now do you see how that host has shown up? There you go. I refreshed it again, and now you can start to see events are coming. So now that we've gotten that, you can come right down to here, and you can try a couple of things. What I wanted to show you to do is just a couple of things, like on 198, just do host equals. So host equals, if I put that up in the search box up here, as soon as I say host equals, you notice I didn't even finish typing it. I didn't even finish typing it, and it starts giving you an example of what of some of the host results that you can see. I do the same thing with source. So I'll do source equals, and now, boom, you can start to see some of these different types of events. Security events, setup, system events, and then source type, same thing. So now you can see all those.